Bitcoin achieved a new milestone on Monday. The flagship cryptocurrency hit a fresh record high for the first time in three years as traders increased their bids in hopes of earning big profits. It was trading as high as $19,864 during the U.S. session, up 9.16% on the day. That trampled its 2017 record high of $19,666, according to data fetched by Coinbase Exchange. The surge came as a part of a bigger and broader rally that started in March 2020. In the month, the Federal Reserve and other central banks injected trillions of dollars into their capital markets. The move weakened the US dollar's purchasing power. Meanwhile, the banks also introduced ultra-low interest rates while committing to purchase treasuries endlessly. That pushed the real yields of the safest government bonds lower, prompting investors to seek profits in riskier assets. Bitcoin, the riskiest among them all, benefited as a result. It surged by up to 415% between March and today. Many analysts agreed that the latest rally came in response to investors' fears of inflation, coupled with an unsettling gold market. Guggenheim Partners, a Wall Street investment firm, said it could invest up to $530 million into BTC via Grayscale's Bitcoin Trust. Meanwhile, Real Vision Group CEO Raul Pal, who was earlier critical of Bitcoin, switched sides by announcing that he is reshuffling his entire gold portfolio into the cryptocurrency market. Cameron Winklevoss, the co-founder of Gemini, a cryptocurrency exchange in the United States, said, the sentiment allowed Bitcoin to break above major resistance levels in a row on Monday. Nevertheless, the cryptocurrency also pulled back lower after topping out, led by short-term profit-taking behavior among day traders.